Hello friends and fellow flute enthusiasts and welcome back to Johnny's Flute Reviews. Today we're going to look at a little flute made by Ray Wood. It's made from, even though his last name is Wood, the flute is made from bamboo. Um, I tease him about that sometimes. This flute is in the key of E, as in echo or everyone. Um, and has just the sweetest tone to it. I really love bamboo flutes for that reason, and I'm a big fan of Ray's work. Um, I first owned a Ray Wood flute very early in my flute playing. Um, I um, picked one up at a festival, um, and he's just got a big heart, and I really love the guy. So anyway, uh, the flute here that I have is in the key of E, made from bamboo. You can see it's kind of small, and typically what we find with smaller flutes like this is that they can tend to be kind of shrill, but the bamboo and the way that Ray works his magic, um, it lends itself to be just a very smooth and mellow, even though it's a high pitch. We do carry these on our website because I fell in love with them and I wanted more people to um, have access to his flutes. We carry these in E, this is the highest key. We carry them in D as in uh, dog and C as in Charlie and A as in alpha. So, uh, and that's not a higher A, that's the mid A. Uh, today we're just gonna talk about this little guy. We got a shipment of these flutes in from Ray and this one stuck out to me. There's something really magical about this one. So it now lives on my, uh, on my desk next to my computer. So when I'm teaching, I can grab it and I can demo um, for flute students and sometimes just to pick up and noodle around with a backing track. Let's hear how this flute sounds. So what do you think? What do you think about the um, the high E flute? Um, this has a very signature um, block design by Ray. It's a piece of bamboo and it's it's contoured to the body of the flute, but made to look like a feather. Um, the flutes that we carry on our website, he does make them occasionally open-ended like this, but most of his flutes offer a wooden mouthpiece and um, some sort of stone inlay here and um, I like the detail that he does on the leather wrapping as well. Just a little crisscross action here. And under the mouthpiece here, this is where we start to see some information. He wood burns this little bamboo uh, grove look uh, with what looks like a little sunshine there, island flute by Ray, and then he puts the key in the sun here. So in this case, it's an E. Um, and so, uh, just a few more details and also the wrapping here that he does around uh, the flute. This is not uncommon to see on bamboo flutes and it's actually preferred. Um, so this is the Island Flute by Ray. Um, and if you want to check these out, we'll leave a link in the description below. We'll also leave a link in the description to Horizons Flute School. This is a platform that we launched not long ago and uh, offers online courses, live Q&A, uh, sheet music and backing track credits, a private community where you can be with members only of that um, group. And that's outside of social media, so no Facebook or Instagram or any of those things. Um, so anyway, this is something that I wanted to put together to support flute students and help you uh, learn and grow on your flute journey. So if you're interested in that, 
please see the link in the description below. Hey, I appreciate you tuning in today. Thanks for watching. Um, I'd love to know your thoughts on this flute, or if you have a question, if we can support you in any way, please leave a comment in the description or in the comments below, and we'll come by and offer support to you. If you have a more detailed question, feel free to reach out, and uh, we hope to see you in another video soon. Take care. Hi friends, thanks so much for watching this video. If you're looking to grow as a flute player and achieve more in your flute journey, click below. If you're looking for more videos like this, see the playlist in the corner. And lastly, please consider subscribing so you're among the first to know when new videos drop. Thanks again, see you soon.